I don't want to share how long I'm going to be here because that guy watches my vlog. I saw it! I saw my girl! I'm so excited! First of all, I want to apologize for coming on here like this. So I just found something that I just had to share um, right now so I can show you guys like for real um, my raw reaction to this. Anyway, so apparently this this website called Unistar has featured me on their front page. Not like Judith's Foreign Life, kind of like Nigerian YouTuber Judith's Foreign Life dumped by Caucasian husband on their channel. You think I'm kidding? No, it's right there. It is exactly right there. <laughs> it's, it's not flattering. I don't think it's a nice stuff to paste on your website. But that's that's how it works, isn't it? That's you just we put up stuff that and I'm not I'm not like upset or mad or whatever. I mean no way upset. Um I am just surprised and dumbfounded. First time I find myself being featured on any website, you think it would be something positive, right? Oh, and there's the cool thing also. My um <laughs> my story has the most views apparently I guess people want to see a woman get dumped I guess that's like a hot thing online <clears throat> off to meet someone that's interested in my car I'm really hoping and hoping that she buys the car fingers crossed in front of the camera I guess <laughs> I am here waiting for the lady that was supposed to come and look at my car today I just showered, I didn't do anything to my hair or face. I just jumped out because I was to make sure I was on time. She's not here yet. 16 minutes, she's not here yet. God, please let her come and please let her take the car. Oh, please. Okay, I think that's her. I saw it! I saw my car! I'm so excited! Oh my god! Gosh, I'm so excited. It's about the fact that I can finally move on because I cannot just leave this car on the side of the road or something. I'm gonna get thousands of bills. Um, anyways, I'm so excited. They want it. I saw it. Yay, 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 yay. I'm gonna like jump, but I can't because I'm everyone's looking at me right now in public. But I'm so excited. Guess who's calling me? You kidding me? You seriously kidding me? I'm here. I'm over here trying to get my nails done. I told him I was going to talk to him or pick up his calls or whatever if he has anything to talk to my mom. <laughs> is he outside? Let me see if he's outside. I don't know what's going on here. I wasn't going to keep on vlogging until I had my nails done and I got my face ready for my videos I need to make today. But this man has been calling. What do you want, Garvis? I told you to talk to my mom if you need anything, anything at all. Anything that belongs to me, anything of mine that you have, anything that's mixed in you right now, I don't care. If I cared, I would have spoken to you about it. The fact that I'm asking you not to talk to me means I don't care. I'm just trying to get all of this done and move on with my life. I don't know why I agreed to talk to him. I don't know what's wrong with me. Every time I talk to him, it just, just weighs me down. I'm going to do what I can to get my spirits up. Let me play me some music, watch something energizing. I was going to film, but I don't know if that's going to happen right now. I was stupid enough to pick up the phone. The plan was... I told him not to call me. I cannot do, I cannot handle it emotionally. Don't call me. I don't care what you take and what you don't take. I don't care about property. If God will be with you at this time, do not delete your channel. Remember that infamous celebrity Kim Kardashian, I don't know how that relates to me, monetized the heck out of her experience. Write a tell all. Start a tribe of broken hearted women all over the world. You got this. That's what she wrote on the stuff. I can link it down below. Um. Check it out guys. I glued my lashes on. It took me 20 minutes maybe. 
it's not supposed to take that long but I got it done I haven't glued lashes in such a long time I haven't done any other makeup just my eyes I like to focus on my eyes because like your eyes are like the center of your beauty so if you want to do makeup if you're gonna focus on any part of your face focus on your eyes and then ignore the rest okay don't ignore the rest but focus on your eyes okay so I got it all done um, I got my lashes my lashes done they are extremely longer than I'd like them to be though <sighs> and as for lining my eyes I don't know you know I'm not gonna focus on every single thing next time I'm gonna get them a little bit shorter because too long makes it look like a doll eyelashes I called a beauty salon just to like figure out like what is the estimate price of um what you call it of, um, of um, eyelash extensions the one that lasts you a while like days or even weeks yeah and the one that lasts you I think a couple of weeks was like um she said $200 and then like $200 for my eyelash like this little thing on here like this this little thing on my eyes, I'm gonna pay you $200 to put, to glue on some fake ones. Let me call you back. Nah, I'm not calling back. Um, so yeah, yeah, I got my, I got my makeup on and I'm feeling, I'm feeling a lot better than, you know, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling awesome. I got rid of the hair because I don't, I'm tired of that hair. I need to, I'm gonna buy a new one when I get, when I'm all settled down, I'm gonna buy myself a new hair. I still do have hair, so I just have it all tucked in there. In case you're wondering, in case you're like, does she have hair? I don't know this lady very well. Literally, yesterday was my wash day, and today was my like final chance of wash day day because I have like wash days according to like I don't know. I, I I schedule things weird. I have my real wash day, my final chance wash day, and my early wash day. It's crazy, but I am stretching my wash day. You see my hair? Can't really do much with it because it's so oily and it's ready to be washed. I'm scratching my wash day as much as possible so that when I get to my brothers, I can um, I can stay here. I can I can go a little bit longer without washing my hair because the more I stretch this one, the more I can stretch the next one. If that makes sense, I hope it does. Now I don't have my car. You guys are probably gonna be walking with me if I need to go somewhere. There's a plaza right next to this place where I can go just to get things I need to get, and probably just be walking with me. And probably most of the time I'll be at home packing, so it won't be any much of anything doing on till I'm all done here. Oh, and by the way, I don't think I showed you, but these are my nails. Um, I think I showed you doing them, but I didn't show you the finished look. Um, basically, I'm not using the sticker anymore because I have like short fingers, and girly fingers are normally long and girly. And I feel like artificial nails that are longer than my nails makes my finger look, I don't know, longer and girly. Anyways, I really like it, especially this one. It makes it look more African-y maybe, I don't know. And then these ones just make it look cute. And then the that just accented right there. Currently editing my next upload to my natural channel. I've been stalling for way too long, but it needs to be up. So I'm gonna work on that so it can be up next Wednesday. And I don't have my car anymore, and I just wanted to ask you guys to um, let me know what is what is something that I can do that I don't have to be inside all day. Um, I probably will have to be inside uh, putting everything together. I think someone wants to get my TV tomorrow, which would be amazing. And oh, do I call the Salvation Army to take furniture I can't sell? Please let me know. I need your help. Um, so I think someone said call Salvation Army, but I can't find the comment. So I can't like figure out, this. did she say Salvation Army or did she say someone else? Um, so let me know, do I call Salvation Army to take like my dining table and then any other furniture I can't sell? And um, if you have any idea of anything I can do um, that doesn't have me sitting inside all day, one of the most popular um, comments um, or tip I've gotten is try not to be alone or just keep yourself busy. And my mom said um, try not to be inside all day. Basically, just don't be alone too much. She's gonna mess with my head. Um, so what do you think I can do? I don't have my car. <laughs> what does someone do when they don't have your car? Um, Excuse me. I think one of my eyelashes falling off, isn't it? <laughs> Let me know if you have any other idea. I'm gonna be here for... I don't wanna share how long I'm gonna be here because that guy watches my vlog. <laughs> Somebody said, um, I'm sure he's the one that thumb, that's always thumbs in down my video. Thumbs in down, is that a word? Because all of my videos have at least one thumbs down. Like someone is just going around just 
making sure everything is thumbs down. So that's what he said. That's what so, someone um, commented. And I think I honestly, honestly, honestly think that person is right. I watched a little bit of vlogs and couple vlogs. I watched a family vlog and I was just like, oh my gosh, such a beautiful family. This is what I do for myself. But life always has something else for you, doesn't it? Yeah, life says, uh -uh, I have a different plan for you. Okay, that's fine life. I won't fight you. Let's see where you're taking me. Please give me a thumbs up and please subscribe uh, for future videos. Thank you guys for watching guys and thank you so much for your support. Bye guys.